Welcome to this series where we are playing Reforged Eden for Imperium Galactic Survival. In the last part, we went out and found the Heidelberg over here. And I did a little bit of checking around this area, and there doesn't seem to be much in the way of resources. So in this part, what we're going to do is expand the search area just to find some key resources, possibly work our way towards, I'm assuming this will be a Talon village, but before that, a big thank you for your comments and feedback. <laughs> you guys give me so much to think about. Now, I did get a suggestion about the fact that I should be looking underwater for resources to be able to get up to level 7. I'm not going to do that in this part because I do want to get out and about on the motorbike. But on the positive side, if I show you here, I've mined out the iron, silicon and copper here. And from so from the perspective of the workshop we are now if i come down to oh, we got to find the thing because the workshop doesn't want to do it we now have the resources to actually build the merlin we're just not at level seven that did a little bit off camera is i went out and killed a couple of uh, the friendly creatures so we've got a pile of steak which will probably rot but there's not much i can do about that but you can see we're, we're fairly close to getting to level seven, which is going to be the primary objective of this part. Now, the I, I think the other thing I just want to show you is we've got quite a lot of resources in here. Uh, just pick up a little bit more in the way of sniper rifles. We got plenty of oxygen. We got um, some medication, and I'm just going to take the purified water with me just so that is what I can do with purified water and carbon substrate is make these in here if should I need it. In fact, I wouldn't mind just taking a little bit of carbon substrate with me as well, just in case. But So what we're going to do is go out on the bike, but rather than go this way round, the top of the lake, I want to go underneath the lake so that we can open up what's down below here. So we're just going to go in this direction because what I'd like to do is find a location which we can use to actually build a base because we're going to need to build a base to get 15 millimeter ammunition which is a little bit of a pain in the neck but I don't think there's much else we can do. I mean I wouldn't mind finding a pteropod or something like that along here as well. I mean the alternative is that we actually kill... We have to watch the temperature. In fact, did I bring my thermal regulator with me? Yeah, yeah because when I came out here to actually mine the uh, the what we call it, <laughs> the I think it was the iron out here. Uh, the actual temperature got a little bit high. Right, let's just kind of ping out. With we don't have a. There's nothing else in here. So we're going to have to keep an eye on that temperature and drop the thermal regulator should we need it. But I'm just going to keep picking up the, the rocks here, partly for XP, partly for uh, resources should we need it. Now if any of you have followed my previous series, you know that I'm slightly adverse to actually... Okay, we've got a, we've got a slimy here. I haven't actually fought one of these for a little while, so we'll just go and... Give him here. We got 400 points for that. Yeah, we got an Adrazone, as a whatever that is. <laughs> so that's given us a little bit of extra um, XP. So we'll just curve round the base of the lake here and see if we can. Jump off very quickly. Oh, still nothing around here. I'm hoping. What I really would like to do is find a source of promethium, so that we've got a, an energy source for the base. Or not seeing anything around here. Any great interest, though. Although I have to admit, I haven't. Although I have to admit, I haven't had much luck with starter planets for the last couple of series that I've done. I've 
tended to <laughs> always start on planets that don't have a large quantity of resources where we just alien thought is something that's worth picking up because it doesn't perish and we might be able to sell it to the Talon and of course it gives us a little bit of XP if we can find any more creatures here I think we're reasonably okay for temperature at the moment the suit is protecting me so, uh, so we've come right round the bottom here um, I think we've got a potential radiation source here I uh, don't want to get too close but it'd be good if I could uh, there. Oh, we got some some of these guys as well. Uh, so, God, no Promethium. Now these are have the potential to be friendly, but at the same time, they can. Uh, what we get here? Just get up really close. Uh, whoops! Run out of ammunition. They're all coming towards me. Oops. <laughs> um, I think I might have bitten off a bit more than I can chew. We've got to level seven, if nothing else. <laughs> right, we got to level seven, and. So let me just get in here so we'll just get to the workshop. Um, we can start production. It's going to take 36 minutes. So we probably won't get access to the bike in this part. But what I'm really after is the alien tooth and the alien parts because that will allow us to make medication. Uh, I won't eat the raw meat because it'll probably give us indigestion. Meat has a. I think we're, there's a little bit of Promethium just there. I think at the moment I'm, I'm be grateful for anything I can get. Got six Promethium there. Actually, if I stand here, jump to here. Okay, still no. Right, can't afford to be in the this area too long because. This suit doesn't give us that much protection, but we got a tiny amount of lithium. Um, okay, I think we'll head for the village now and see what we can find. In fact, there's a radar signature over there. Hopefully, that might be promethium. Uh, yeah, we found a small promethium deposit, and there's a little bit of promethium on the. It's just up there. Uh, just kind of rush in and I'm not ow ow wait get out go away jump on no 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 we'll go this way alright there's a golem I'm in trouble Right, we got some resources from that. Oh, that nearly got me killed. <laughs> right, let's just get out of here. I've got me. I need to get out of here as quickly as possible. Uh, yep. Oh! I want your radiation. I haven't actually taken any radiation on board, which is good. <laughs> so we found Promethium. And what did I put? Oh, okay, we're getting cooked now. We need to cool off a bit. So hopefully this will just reduce us down a little bit. And while we're doing that, we'll just take a quick look. So we got some copper, some iron. So we didn't get anything particularly that exotic, which is unfortunate. But that is the way it is. Um, just jump back on the bike. Yeah, there's some really hot parts around this planet here at the moment. So, uh, oops, click on that. 
just I think we will work our way towards the village and just see what we can find uh, I can't pick up any more rocks or anything uh, which is okay so we'll just head straight for the village right, we've just entered Talon territory now so we got to be very careful now we're in Talon territory not to pick anything up because if I come in here and if we find, where is it uh, come to we should we haven't met the Talon yet once we meet the Talon what we should be able to do is find out what we can and can't do but the, but the golden rule when you're in Talon territory especially when you first meet them don't pick anything up don't mine anything and also be aware that you can't stay here too long but we will get to the village and see what we can do. Wow, it's really hot here. Right, we got a radar signature here. I right, found another iron deposit. I'm probably missing other deposits because of the way I'm driving here. I'm not throwing out a scan, but that'll be okay. Because hopefully the the SV will have a scan. So. Found a Talon Brewery. We've got a. There we go. Can't be right. These people are primitive housing. We can't have the capacity for it. Into So we've got here. Nevertheless, Commander, we're not described the. It seems you may be right, Commander. Nevertheless, these creatures were not described in the Heidelberg's logs and should be investigated for potential information. So uh, we best to approach the times. The best approach the times between regular drone patrols commander we cannot help us and cause unnecessary problems to them if they found in so a okay, crop build right the chief is over there so uh let's go over to the wow okay uh, we're gonna have to um we need some oxygen as well pop up the oxygen got sport food we can trash that we don't need it probably don't need the stone it's like a universal um right we need a bit of health uh, i think we'll be okay for health wise at the moment what we got to do now is get across here and we'll go and speak to the leader and we certainly don't want to upset the talent because I would like to do a bit of trading if possible. Looks pretty basic actually, which is unfortunate, but we've got in here. Hello guys. Just go and talk to the chief. Yeah. Um the oh well <laughs> I'm not even gonna try and say that. Uh I'm sorry I don't understand your language. Um, um, Talon, that's something Xerax, so the problems are Talon. Okay, how am I supposed to? Chief points to a tapestry depicting a pyramid like tower struck by lightning. Here, um, I guess we're done here. Did you get any of that idea? Best that I've got is the chief wants us to go to some tower somewhere. Okay, I recommend the conversation identified the structure indicated. It's quite far from your current location, but it's emitting low ele electromagnetic signature. Shall I send the location to your data display? Go ahead, idea. Um, so we've got to go to a tower, which isn't a bit of a surprise, isn't a surprise. Um, we don't have any money, but we don't have anything to sell him either. Oh, it's annoying. Okay. The IDA is talking to me. Unlikely though. The camera in your suit is liable to observe other tribesmen while they spoke with achievement. Most of the people in the village displayed no aggression towards you or mere curiosity. Okay, so we're actually getting conversations from these guys. Let's see if we can talk to anyone. Liquors, beer, spice, natural sweetener. Okay. Anybody else around here that... Because one of the changes in the new update is they've actually increased the trading 
capabilities. So we might be able to friend that looks like my farms have produced that have not seen anything that's glorious. Trudeau cannot be outdone by any Polaris farmer. Let's see. You look worried. What's this? I'm worried. My mushrooms are sensitive to changes in temperature and lately you're getting cold nights. Far colder than previous cycles. It looks as though we may lose the entire crop if it drops sharply. I do like to cover my farm with brilliant nanofiber mesh, but the Xerox will likely burn it to ashes to see such an advanced mature in the hands of the talons. Perhaps if you bring me 10 thermal regulators instead. Of course, we can get missions. Okay. Um, okay. It wears. No, this is just nutrient solution. We've got some nutrient solution. We could have. Um, I wonder if you'd have bought some. Uh, okay. So we. How, how's it? Let's have a look at the suit constructor. What's it? We need 10 thermal regulators. It only needs two iron ore. Okay. Um, we'd need to unlock it, wouldn't we? Maybe under miscellaneous. Where's the thermal regulator? We've got the points for it. Oh, okay, we've got another guy here. Right, alien thorn. Ah, he won't buy it. That's annoying. A repeating crossbow crossbow belts you can buy a crossbow not that i really want one right let's have a look we got an ancient tower over there um i'm really interested in so where's the ancient tower the broken into the ancient tower is there one kilometer away i'm gonna take a chance and we're gonna go and check it out and see what we can find then we've come this far it's not like it's that far apart way if we can pick up some iron ore outside of talon territory um we could probably make those uh, what we call it these thermal regulators that we can get there so we'll go and check out the ancient tower um, we're still in T talon territory so we've got to be a bit careful We're just nothing around here. Uh, I don't think we're really going to be able to search the planet until we go. You're approaching the tower now, Commander. I'm detecting faint electronic readings coming from beneath the structure. Um, spike up. Um, one thing I do want to do is just uh, reload that. I know we lose ammunition in Reforged, but um, there's part of me that because I'm um, actually we're just gonna put the oxygen up again. We're gonna double shot it, and I think we're get our health up maximum. Well, because I'm pretty sure that this is where we come in and we get trapped. Oh no, we can actually go down. Okay, the design and structure is more advanced than the Talon village. It's seen in many similar, but the design of this structure is more advanced. Oh, okay, sorry, I missed that. There could be many reasons, Commander. Now, if I'm correctly, the wall blows up, but I'm assuming we got it. Okay. Ah, there's a top of my... Yeah, that's at the top of my list. Now, why send me here? Show me what they once were. These devices appear to be some kind of holographic terminal and may contain answers to questions. There's no power. I'm detecting an energy source going beyond the wall by pushing against the wall. So we've got to find which wall uh, we need to push against. Um, that's it here. Okay. Flip the switch. Looks like the power is on IDA. All the lights are displayed or lit up. Now, I'm reading increased data traffic. It's remotely connected to computer systems. It's operating on base eight numerical systems. That's Octal. Complete moment to transfer the loading talent transition translation key to HDD. So we're actually going to get the translation key here. Forward in translation to hard and audio outputs. In the year something, I'm not going to read all this in detail. I think what it does is 
it gives a backstory to the Talon in the sense that they were once very technologically advanced and had some form of relationship with the Xerax. And then for some reason, I think it was because of war with the Xerax, they decided to regress back to take a more basic uh, life form, I think. Yeah, it appears the details of the rise of the Talon 2,000 years ago. It's a long time the allies, the conditions are now guessing more recent history. Okay, and then Red, Red Console is next. So, uh, Translation key, forward into hub. Uh, so the silent spread, yeah. Be naive as we were, bound, with merged now. Once again, take the form and the silence and the spread the stain across the galaxy. It doesn't seem to have anything on the Xerox about Tycoon of War. The enemy is strong enough to topple the form. We've found thousands of references to the legacy. This is introduced in the legacy aspect of the game. A little information. We can't leave this effective to happen this 400 years ago. The Xerox are still here. We need to know about the dead enemy that we never run into. Okay. And the legacy is not completely destroyed, merely rendered. Nothing says how the talent ended up here. I'm not sure that it would be recorded here. Such an operation has been surgically leaving nothing out. Okay, leave the console. And we actually got to go and check the green console now. Okay. Run in translation key forwarding. This console only seems to have a database of talent control planets, food, dances, cultural relations. Probably what the chief wanted me to read. The console appears to claim information on talents of people. Personally, I find it fascinating. And you're able to upload the connection to the console so I can store it in the UCH database. Yes. Um, one of my parameters is to investigate and document contact spaces. Does this mean you're investigating those um, spiders that have been running into as well? I'd like to know more of the creatures have been encountered. Of course, we haven't encountered any spiders on here. Sorry, Commander. Heat sector moving towards the tower. I'll then trace the transport back half a kilometer. Apologies. Hostiles are talking about. Here's they're taking flanking positions. One on top of the tower to prevent your escape. Two preparing to breach. So I think the Allen are here. Let's get a fire position. So, are they going to breach in or do I have to go up? Can I go up. Um. Haha, <laughs> black guys. There's another one. I think there's another one here. Okay, we'll just have to kind of put down here. Grab this. Oh, come on, guys. Uh, is can Street. The I think I might have preempted. I think I've killed them, but the mission hasn't moved on. I think because I didn't wait for them to breach. <laughs> okay. I think we can. Strike team, eliminate the Xerox strike team. Um, sweep and clear. Right, we're going to just progress that forward. Um, good work, Commander. All targets eliminated. In a short time, they'll be gotten as close as you did. So, what have we got to do now? Very soon, a short time, they've only gotten close by. Right, so. Anyway, the Xerox have beaten us, have someone told us we were coming. But feeling the Talon are not as peaceful as they claim. So what are we going to do now? Suspicion. Does that mean we've got to go back to the Talon settlement? Where is it? Where's that? It's over here, isn't it? So we've got to... Oh, no. right, it looks like we've got to go back to the chief, so... So, uh, Yeah, I, I suppose what I was supposed to have done is waited for them to breach into the building. Um, which is what used to happen with the mission. So we'll go back and speak to the chief. See if we can get this all done in this part. Um, actually, what is our standing with the, uh, the talent? Let's have a quick look at that now, because we should. So they're neutral at the moment. We 
we've got to go a long way before we improve our standing. There's something creeping up behind me, I can hear it. So uh, let's get back to the chief and see what we can do. Oops. What was that? Was there something? There was something bump back there. What was it back there? Let me just, sorry, getting distracted, but I'm sure. Or was it just a talon um, guy? Anyway, we'll just walk into the chief now and have a word with him. Actually, what else do we get from there? We've got a loaf of bread. <laughs> oh, we might as well eat that and we'll eat the fruit as well. Although I haven't, don't have any herbal leaves, so that's a bit risky. Come up the oxygen. Got some projectile ammunition. We've got a rifle upgrade kit. And another 23 credits. In fact, I should have brought my credits with me, shouldn't I? Got that. That's okay. We can come back and trade with them. Because we're going to come back and do those thermal regulators. I think that could be worth doing. See, we've got a farm here. But if we touch it, they're going to get very upset with us. So we certainly don't want to do that. Suspicion return to the Talon Chief. Let's just go. I see you've returned, Traveller. I hope your journey was enlightening. Let me help you. <laughs> yeah, speak. You can speak trade. Wait a second. You can speak trade standard. Got some bad. Yeah, but just a. Of course I do. How else would I purchase supplies and sell ingredients to traders of the trading station? They will send me on. Then you will. Then why send me on a wild goose chase to learn your language and history? It couldn't have been just told me what I wanted to know when, when I first came here. I'm now. I could have, but then you would have learned nothing but for your, for yourself and proved nothing to me. I am now confident that you are neither a Xerox spy or an enemy of the clan. By the way, that what is a goose? Some kind of animal? No, it's an animal, a bird from my home world. But that's beside the point. I was attacked by the Xerox. What? Tower contains a record of our history, much as the Xerox would like to refute it. They would never intentionally destroy such a repository of knowledge, as it may still be of use to their war re resumes again. What can I tell you, Chief? They blew in, in the war to get in and took out one of the consoles and everything behind it. The red one, I think. By the time I'd reached the tower, they'd already landed a safe distance and making their way on foot towards the tower. The knowledge is backed up, so as long as the other console was undamaged, it can be repaired. I can tell you what you're thinking. Someone has told the Xerox patrols where to find you, aren't, aren't you? Not to put a final point on it, Chief, yes. Chains to admit it that you're probably right, Traveller. I even, even understand why they did it. You see, a year ago when the ships of your people crashed on the planet, several villagers were caught in the fires caused by the flaming debris that rained down across the planet. I ordered my people to go and put out the fires of the settlement and those of our neighbours, then aid any survivors from your people's ships. To my sorrow when we tried to help your people, they mistook us for the Xerox and, and our aid for an attack. We lost many people that night. Several of the young hunters lost friends and family members, and I have held a grudge against them. After I sent you to the tower I had to learn the, our ways and language to prove that you are not an enemy, several of the hunters came to me and demanded that I render you no aid. Instead, that I should contact our Xerox jail jailers and trade information for the supplies of weapons. Naturally, I refused that it would be a poor leader to lead any assistance, the Xerox which would enforce the conditions upon us. Unfortunately it seems youngsters did not seem to answer their demands. Now it seems they may have done something unforgivable. What will happen to the hunters now? The youngsters will be apprehended and brought before the tribal council to determine their guilt. Selling out an ally to the Xerox is, a, is the highest crime, I understand. Is there some way I can help? I believe that you, you may meet opposition. On the other hand, I believe some of the other hunters may also refuse to bring in the young youngsters i request that you if you're willing to speak to the head of the hunters and tell him to call in the hunters on my request right away chief but what we got to do now i recall correctly yeah. okay find the head hunter where do we find the head hunter seeking justice wow it's a bit all out here um so where's the 
we got something there. So we got the Talon Monument here. We, we got to walk around and talk to someone or do something. Let's just see what it says in here. Finger Hunter suspected the seeking justice. Okay. Master, ah, oh, he's um, is he up here? There we are. So there you are, Terran. The chief is vouched for. I'm not impressed. I'm not here. Not, I'm not here to impress you. I'm here because the chief asked me to tell you. No members of my hunters would dare sell out anyone to those treacherous Xerix thugs. Dare accuse my kin. I'm not accusing anyone. I'm here to make sure you call the hunters instead of warning them. My people have no reason to flee your false ac ac accusations, Terran. I've already sent out a message to bring the hunting parties an hour ago. Are they back? Well, no, they should have returned some time ago. But this does not mean that they're guilty of anything. It's something they've delayed that might cause trouble. Then I'll go out and bring them in myself. No, you no, you will not, Terran. I will go out and you will accompany me to ensure that there's no dis um, deception. I can live with that. Where are we going? The young Kiev is the closest. He should be near the stone monument at this time of day. I will meet at the top of the tower, but I cannot find him. He's unlikely to be near the tower or visible. Okay, let's head out. So, I'm assuming that the monument is over there. Make sure we uh, go there. That was okay, ammunition wise. Um. I think we can just get this done and then that will be it for the video. Um, don't like fighting in the dark, but um, we're probably going to have to um, be a little bit careful. See the monument with no sign of the traitorous huntsman. Hunter or Huntsman, I'll check the base. Commander, I recommend caution when approaching the Talon Hunter. He may attack. If you try to bring him in by force, it will only worsen the situation. Okay. We get into... Yeah, maybe there's a way in here. No. Nope. The heck do we get into it? Oh, it looks like there's a entrance here. Stop right there, deceitful, violent, savage. I don't know how you trick the fool the chief. I'll give you a chance to sprout your lies at me. I haven't tried to lie at anyone. Save your lives, Terrence. Your people have murdered my father. The only crime of your kind. Okay, never forgive your kind, Terrence. Don't try it, Kip. You don't stand a chance. I think you can bring me in. I guess we're going to have to do it the hard way then. Right here. That'd be... The question is, where is he? One, uh, not exactly short. Back into here. Um. I'm feeling the mission is a little bit bugged because. That is the second one I've um, I've killed both of them and we don't seem to be advancing the mission. <laughs> right guys, uh, let's go back into here, eliminate the Xerox soldiers. Okay, just do it that way. I think because there's two, only two of them, isn't there? Okay, let me just... What do we get for that? We've got the ubiquitous sandwich, we've got some herbal leaves, we've got a little bit of gold, we've got some plant protein. Um, do with some 
Uh, idea I can monitor this location, make sure no one disturbs the bodies. I'm sure Kiev wasn't alone in his actions. Turn to the chief. Okay, we're back to the chief again, guys. Um, just get back to here. I mean, having the, sh the sniper rifle really makes a difference. And if any of you guys start a playthrough, always get the sniper rifle and learn how to use it. It just makes such a big difference with um, these early missions. I see you've returned, Traveller, but what? But without the missing hunter, Keeve? No. You do not need to explain. One of our hunters already saw you gun down Keeve on top of the monument. Our it saddens me that you would work to gain our trust and only kill the clansmen in cold blood. I was only defending myself after he attacked. Uh, well, we Talon are not violent people. We never initiate attack. We will not respond if, if attacked. In any case, you've already received the word of Keeps body is found alone. Place the monument with several holes matching your weapon. There's no other bodies. I will not lie. And the bodies were removed after I left the, to return here. Now. Uh, where Terran was true, I saw with my own eyes. Keeve was a traitor. Hunt, hunt master. You lost so many of your hunters to the Terrans. Would you truly vouch for this one? You you who cried loudest for vengeance against the Terran interlopers. Yes, Chief, I wanted Keeve to lead a party of... of uh, yes, Chief, I watched Keeve lead a party of four Zeric soldiers to the monument, initiate an attack with the Terran, who I sent them to the monument to wait for it to bring the Keeve peacefully. Okay, so there was four hunting there, wasn't it? I am the head of the hunters for a reason, Terran. I know my way around a knife and the Xerox body armor. What I want to know is how you know the bodies were removed. I am commander of the UCH for a reason, Hunter. I have my ways. You have the machine mind, ya ha ha. If you think you can pull the fur over the Chief Sky's friends, does the machine mind know who took away the bodies that are surely illegal in Keeve's schemes? With no way to identify them, all I can tell you is that there were four of them. Then I know who they are. They are the only four hunters still out on patrol who did not heed the summons, Chief. But but that is an issue for another time, is it not? Yes, I believe, Huntmaster. I'm sorry, Traveller, that you come to us in a time of weakness. I must truly be getting old, but I cannot see the darkness brewing within our youths. Not your fault. True, but the fault lies with me for not realising how troubled our clansmen are. Also lies with them not being... Their troubles before me, the situation worse than they have. Things could be much worse, so I'm glad that the crisis was averted, even if the result isn't what anyone could have called positive. You are not now welcome among our clans, travellers. Uh, Stephen Silverbird, rest and it be easy. There's anything we can do to help you. Where did the Terran survivors go? Your clansmen, their vehicles headed to the trade station belonging to Polaris traders. I know this because I was purchasing medical supplies when I saw them organising transportation off world. I'll give you the coordinates of the station if you need them, but be sure your machine mind has already found the structure. I hope you find your people again, Traveller. May the spirits guide you. May your spirits guide you too, Chief. Farewell, Chief. We've gained 1,500 reputation, and we're now on an industrial concerns. On the location of the data provided by the Talon Chief, I have identified a neutral station for which the UCH survivors left the planet. There are many transmissions... So where are we going to go now then? Can't see anything here. Uh, oh, that's the ancient tower. If I had to make a guess, Commander, I would say that this is from the trading station devoted solely to buying and selling and shipping cargo. It seems to be completely unarmed aside from a small security detail. We should be safe to go there. No Xerox presence. I don't want to get there and find another ambush waiting for me. There's little chance of, of that, Commander. I am keeping watch over the surrounding area. You are safe. I have forwarded the location to your display. So I was preempting it. So we're going to go up there now. I think first what we're going to do is go back to base. That's something I would do off camera. So this is where I'm going to leave it. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Hope you found it interesting. In the next part, we'll get the SV up and running and try and get out and explore a, a bit more. Probably visit the trade station and hopefully be able to get some better smiths and pieces from it. Some 15mm ammunition would be quite nice. And possibly we need to look for a base location so we can make some ammunition for the SV. In fact, let's just have a quick look. So we've got about 20 odd seconds left for the SV. So that would be something we're going to bring in in the next part. But until next time, 
whatever you do enjoy your gaming